We're Star and Daniel, and this cutie is our pup Aspen. Oh boy. We've been spending the last couple of years exploring everything Canada's great outdoors has to offer. We even spent the night in a Quincy, which is similar to an igloo that we built ourselves. This year, we've decided to put a canopy on our truck and convert the inside into a tiny home on wheels for us to travel and live in full time. These are very strange stickers. They're wood stickers. They're pretty cool. Time to put it all on the cooler. Whoa, what the heck? Look at that. <laughs> sure what's happening but there's a cop over there stopping traffic and a helicopter searching so we think maybe there's something but maybe something happened and there's search and rescue out here but we're not really sure is there I don't know about that I don't know if that's search and rescue well what could it be they look like they're looking oh they're definitely looking but, but for what? I don't know if it's for a search and rescue purpose. I'm here to explain what's going on. <laughs> what do I know? Absolutely nothing. That's not true. <laughs> I know that I asked the cop if there was a way into the park or if the, like, a different way or if the whole park was closed and she just said, I don't know. <laughs> but she was like, we might have it wrapped up soon. I was like, okay. <laughs> We're at the Myra Canyon trestles. They're really cool. They're old train bridges, um, the Kettle Valley Railway in Kelowna. I will see if we can check them out or not, because this is very strange. Yeah, it is strange. <laughs> yeah, I wonder what he's circling now. Like, I don't really know. So we're gonna go back to town. Because, I mean, if this is a search and rescue operation or something, it could take a long time. So, we're gonna leave. Yeah, no sense in waiting around. No. We are headed to a dog beach. We haven't filmed all that much today. We were gonna go to Meyer Canyon, and then that happened. And then we just found ourselves going to restaurants eating really good food. <laughs> so we've kind of just had a food tour. And yeah, we don't really film that, so. <laughs> yeah. Um, but we're at Ellison Lake Provincial Park near Vernon, and it's, yeah, it's gorgeous. It's, it's really, really nice. well kept area. Very well Very kept. nice facilities, very that. nice but, camping sites. Well, someone drove in there, but like you can see the, the tire tracks, like it's so well raked. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, you can see. Uh, like, it's just very nicely kept. Facilities are very nice. Aspen is a very picky eater. Well, she just doesn't like her food, I guess. I don't know. Every once in a while, we try to switch things up, but she just doesn't want it. So we kind of have to find ways to get her to eat it. She also has a very sensitive stomach, so we can't really switch her food. And we've tried a couple times very, very slowly, and it never works. So, this is what so, we've resorted to. Apparently hand feeding is the way. That's how we have to do it. We are at an orchard in Vernon. Vernon is where we are. It's called Davison Orchard. <laughs> <laughs> it's got like a cute setup though. There's like lots to see around here. Yeah, yeah. And there's fresh strawberries and rhubarb. Rhubar, right? Yeah, because yeah. they're in season right now. So I'll get myself some of those. 
and whatever else looks good in there. I, yeah, we're allowed to walk around with Aspen, I'm pretty sure, so let's go take a look. in there <laughs> I thought you'd be a while oh god like I wanted to get more too but I already spent $50 <laughs> I bought three things of strawberries yeah. I bought some stickers uh -huh. oh stickers cute, oh. Cute. yeah oh very nice oh perfect yeah. and I bought uh, I was gonna buy jam but I always find jam too sweet mm. But I found this peach and cherry butter. Oh. It's it's more fruit, less sugar. It's basically jam, but more fruit. Oh, cool. So. Oh, we should get some bread. Yeah, bread. I was going to actually buy some. There's a bread dip in there, like from a local place that makes local, like, balsamic vinegars and oils. Oh, okay. And, yeah, it looks good. <laughs> <laughs> And yeah, there's so many different kinds of jams, and there's so many different kinds of everything in there. And you know what is absolute horse crap? <laughs> I can buy it. Look, okay. Yeah, look wait. These show us strawberries. Some strawberries. Oh, yeah. Look at how good those look. Those look really Holy good. Holy mother. <laughs> Same price as the grocery store. Wow. Yeah. Actually. Orchard fresh. Orchard fresh delicious. strawberries. Yeah. From and you know where you got it from. Same price as the grocery store, or actually it could even be a little cheaper. Sometimes like strawberries up north are like ten dollars a clamshell. They can be a lot, yeah. And usually they're five ninety nine though. But yeah, these are five ninety nine. Like oh look at these ones too, man. <laughs> Just, oh no. Oh no. This is like Gold. <laughs> look at these, man. Yeah. <laughs> they look so good. It's just wild, though, because, like, you know, you go to, like, let's say Safeway or Save All Foods or whatever. You go to the strawberries, and it's all, like, uh, a lot of the time it's, like, Driscoll brand. Or, yeah. and, and it's always from, like, California. No offense. Yeah. But why are we not getting it from here? Yeah, like, the ones from the grocery store are good, but when we can get them locally, why are we shipping yeah. them? <laughs> it makes absolutely no sense. That store was really dangerous. I almost bought everything, but I had to control myself. Uh, I mean, you won't know that from the first purchase I'm gonna Whoa, show you. What the? Cool. I bought sponge toffee because if you haven't had sponge toffee, you're missing out. It's really good. But I also bought this bread dipper. Mm. It's from an Okanagan uh, vinegar brewery. So that's not yeah. interesting. That stuff's good. We've yeah. had their balsamic vinegar before. Yeah. Oh, and I bought a uh, sourdough bread from a local bakery as well. And then, so uh, this place is actually known for making their own apple juice. So mm. picked up some of that. Yeah, it's no sugar or water added, just plain old apple juice. 
I had a bit of an accident. I ate an entire thing of strawberries when you were in there. What? <laughs> <laughs> Did Aspen get them? Yeah. <laughs> My God. Dude, I bit into one and it exploded. It was the best strawberry I've had in a hell of a long time. I almost bought so many things. Like, I, it took all of my willpower to walk past the syrups, the fruit syrups. Oh, yeah. And it took all my willpower to not buy a candle, and I smelled mm -hmm. like 10 candles. Like, I almost <laughs> bought one. But I was like, no, no, no candle. Don't buy it. You <laughs> should try a strawberry, though. Holy my like, god. Uh, guys, like, you need to come to this place. It's I'm cool. serious. Like even it's a wonderful place for kids because they've got like the petting zoo and the playground and like a bunch of kids stuff to do. But for adults too, like they've got ice cream. They've got a little. They've got a. I think it's called a bistro, um, but it has like all local stuff from the farm and like oh, you just have to come here. You just have to come. It's amazing. Yeah, it really. Is. I can't believe those strawberries are the same price as the garbage. I'm sorry. Like the stuff in the grocery store is garbage compared to those. <laughs> Okay, let me let me try one. Let me get in here. Oh, they're so good. It literally blew up. <laughs> oh my god. It has so much flavor. Oh no. <laughs> so juicy. I know. It's like not that I don't know mm. what they do to it to make like I don't know if mm. you have the same problem, but like what we get in the store is like hard, it has no flavor, and they're huge. These are so good. Wow. And they're actually red inside instead of white. They're like completely white on the inside when you buy them from like, the grocery store. No way. Well, I mean, you guys might know if you live here. Maybe in the U.S. it's the same. I think it's a little bit different in other countries, but... Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, red like, if we bought that from Safeway up in oh Smithers, it would God. be completely white. I know, they're insane. I ate the whole basket. This stuff is mine. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, I got juice everywhere. I know. It's, yeah, I know it went everywhere. <laughs> this is so good. So, we went in again. Bought more strawberries. More strawberries and more of this apple juice. Because, wow. Like, why do we add sugar? It makes zero sense. And then, Star found a strawberry... Lemonade. Lemonade. Made with fresh strawberries fresh from the strawberries. farm. Oh my god. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> it's a bad noise. Oh, dude, it's so good. <laughs> mm. It's great. It was, yeah, you know, it's a good thing we don't live here. <laughs> good, All of our money would go to this place. Yeah, and I'd be 600 pounds. <laughs> it's a good thing I don't live on an orchard. <laughs> I mean, at least it's all fruit. <laughs> yeah. We're in the middle of something that I didn't think was going to happen. We're like, yeah, we're gonna eat bread and we're gonna eat this, and turns out there was a cork in this. Yeah, we have so this delicious bread dip, but, yeah. but it had a corkscrew in it. Yeah, and oh man, we've been working on cork. this for like 25 minutes. Yeah, because we don't have a corkscrew. Yeah, so, so we've got the key in there. And it was all the way down here, and then I started like pulling it out, and I was like, "Oh my god, we're gonna eat tonight, boys!" <laughs> oh, oh yes, <laughs> yeah, man. So, yeah, if you're ever in a pinch, I guess there you go, <laughs> keys. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Oh yeah, that's good. Mm. He's bought more apple juice. <laughs> Look at us. We got Brussels sprouts and BC grown potatoes. Mm, yeah. We got lots of local stuff in here right now. <laughs> we have some leftover potatoes from the other day and we've been giving them to Aspen and she... We've never really given her potatoes because, I mean, you're not supposed to give dogs not supposed a to give lot a ton, of potatoes. Yeah. She sure likes them. Holy... Yeah. There's a bunch of good stuff in here. Eating healthy on this trip, finally. <laughs> yeah, our first uh, leg of the trip was not so healthy. <laughs>